Well, WashDOT is wrapping up its nearly two decades long HOV lane project in the South Sound. In order to widen I-5, several overpasses have to be taken down and replaced. The next is Tacoma's L Street overpass. King 5's Jenna Hanter tells you what you can expect. Okay. Familiarity is important to Rodney Austin. I stay close to this edge so that I know where it's at. I hate falling off of it. For the last two years, his route to and from work has taken him over the L Street overpass in Tacoma. 15 minutes overall. I stop and grab coffee at the donut shop, though. <laughs> but his route will soon change. The earliest that this overpass is going to close is February 11th. And we have to close it because we're taking it out. Kara Mitchell with WashDOT says this is the last piece of the puzzle in the more than decade long South Sound HOV construction project on I 5 in Tacoma. This overpass, McKinley, uh, Pacific Avenue, they're all vital connections. We've had, you know, had to close each one of them throughout the past four years for construction. WashDOT has been working with Rodney to find another way to work. It's an extra mile walk, approximately, I'm guessing. Uh, because I got to go all the way to Portland Avenue and come back down Puyallup. He says right now his alternative walking route doesn't have sidewalks. <laughs> Without a sidewalk, you don't know where you're going. So you need some kind of guidance. Rodney says getting out and practicing has helped. I didn't know if I could get through it all, but I did work my way up the hill, fortunately, and not wander off into somebody's backyard or whatever. But. <laughs> The biggest challenge, he says. You can't see people's faces and knowing whether or not they're looking at you or not. Once the bridge closes, however, it'll be two years on a new path. Yes. In Tacoma, Jenna Hanchard, King 5 News.